This is a tutorial on how to animate with GIMP. First, you gotta open it up, you know. It takes a while. Drinking water, so you might hear it. All right, so you go in File, click New, or you press Control N, and choose your width and height. Click that. And if it does, if the in the Layers dialog, if that it doesn't show up in there, if like the background layer doesn't show up. Click on either click on that and choose your image or click on that. Once you click on that it should show up every time you open it though. Okay, so I figure out what I'm gonna animate. <clears throat> Let's just do a little stick person. So you draw your figure, your cat or your dog or your person or your ball, even like you can just make a ball moving, but yeah, I was gonna make him walk, I guess. Gimp isn't really that hard to use if you do it right. Oh, oops. Okay, the next thing you want to do is you want to click this, and it has like a picture on the bottom and a picture above, and it's duplicate Kate's your layer. That you could do that, or you can right click on it and choose duplicate layer. It does the same thing. You, you only want one right now. Okay, so what you do is you erase the part that you're going to make move and then you draw the next frame. And then you click duplicate your layer again or right click and duplicate. That's merge the duplicate. And you change it again. If you really want it to be precise, you can go in here and go to opacity and move that down a bit. Don't move it like down to zero because that way you just show the other layer and you can't see the first layer at all. Move it to about 50, maybe a little more like around 70 and then you can see the layer under it and it really helps when you're animating <laughs> duplicate and I'm not going to have his arm move anymore I'm just going to have oh and don't ever forget to like change it to 100% because that'll mess it up. Yeah. Got to change it. Okay. 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 
and this is going to look really horrible because I spent no time on it, but... After you are done animating, you want to go in filters, filters, animation, playback. <laughs> and click play, of course, and there's your animation. <laughs> Close that. When you see that this doesn't show up for some reason, right click, choose filters, animation, playback. Same thing. Anyway, now you know how to animate. Let me turn it on. 